I'm really sad no no, because at home in Bunia, do you know that the case of the M23 makes everyone forget Ichuri? People are dying silently. No one cares while the situation has completely deteriorated. At this very moment, there is great tension in Bunia. I told you the killings continue. The authorities of the state of siege came, instead of fighting the armed groups, they joined forces so that these same armed groups secure the city. Now, these armed groups are fighting in the city. At this very moment in Musatella in the north of the city, there is great tension, there are militias fighting among themselves. The FPIC is attacking the villages. There are tensions, cohabitation becomes impossible. We already had problems of cohabitation between the Hemas and the Lenders. The second thing is that the so-called general who was sent is not a general. He is a gold miner, artisanal miner, Luboyen Kashima. I'll give you a fact very quickly. In the territory of Mambasa in the locality of Nyanya, someone discovered gold in his yard it seems he had a lot of gold. You could get 2 kilos of gold per day. When Luboya heard this, he sent his military justice to shut down the site. The military auditor arrested everyone and seized more than 20 kilos of gold which then disappeared. Afterwards, Luboya took relatives of Thisekedi who claimed to be from the family of Chisikedi the president. One is called Chiri Chisikedi apparently little brother of Chilombo another apparently his cousin who is called Joel Chisikadi. They arrived in Bunia and took this site. They came with a lot of soldiers from the Republican Guard. They themselves began to extract the gold. They kicked out the owner of the site. In this province there is not even a road. Chilombo didn't even build a toilet in Itoyui, but his family takes our province as a legacy from their father.